outdoors with my friend Dave Watson. New Zealand is a magical land of incomparable beauty. A land of lush green valleys and deep mysterious glens that hold countless treasures. A land where sun-kissed mountains stretch as far as the eye can see. It's also the land of huge red stag, the largest in the world, thanks in part to the visions and dreams of this man, Shane Quinn. New Zealand also offers some of the best trout fishing in the world, but to tell you the truth, I never got around to it. I was too busy hunting red stag during the roar, the peak of their breeding season. But first, we had to get to the top of the mountain. Did I say the top of the mountain? I meant the top of the world. What a gift it was just to witness how majestic and proud he appeared as he rounded up his hinds and kept them under close guard, and at the same time constantly testing their scent. So these are uh, Sita uh, backstrokes, which we've wrapped in bacon. We probably baked them at about 180 Celsius for probably about 45 minutes until they're nice and uh, medium rare. And then we've got a little um, red wine juice that we're going to serve with that tonight. And it uh, should be beautiful. Wow. Now that's one dinner I don't want to miss. But first, let's take a look at just a few of the huge stags that Alpine offers. Alpine hunting adventure started back in 1988. I've always been involved in professional hunting, whether it be meat hunting or capturing deer in New Zealand. And it got to the stage where I wanted to spend more time hunting and I didn't know how to do it because the, the meat hunting industry as we know it had finished. So I thought about taking guys out hunting and I was, at the time I was a commercial builder and real estate developer and I started taking out two or three guys from Australia, then a couple from America, then it got to be ten guys and I thought, this hammering and nails is far too hard, I want to go hunting all the time, this is just too much fun and this is where it's ended up now, we've got a big staff of professional hunters on board, we've got a couple of pilots on board and it's been the best thing that's ever happened to me in my life, it's just been awesome. We were glassing for red stag when we spotted a huge bull elk bedded down. Now I tried to stop him with cow calling, but this bull just wasn't interested. So good, I can't stand myself. Huge bull. <laughs> hey, but you know, this is an exceptional. Is a beautiful elk. It's an exceptional bull. That is an incredible animal. Congratulations. Thank you. Good and a good, good, good shot. Good shot. The next afternoon, Trevor and I were back at the top of the world glassing. And try as I may, I just can't describe how breathtaking the beauty of this land is. Then Trevor's eye caught some movement. So he grabbed the elite spotting scope for a closer look. And what he found was not one high silver red stag, but three. Now these stag have spotted us, so Trevor tries to stop them by calling. And 
there's my shot. Down. Down. <laughs> yeah. Congratulations, Damn. man. <laughs> yeah. Not way, congratulations, shooting up like that. I popped myself really hard. Oh, you did get yourself. Am I bleeding? You a little bit. You Am got I yourself bleeding? a little trophy wound. It's worth it. It was worth it. Well done. Ooh. Ooh. That's a big one, isn't it? That's a big boy. <laughs> Look oh. at that. Look at that, Jimmy. Nope. Huh. How beautiful. It's what been it's all blast. about. Yep. It's been a blast. Thank I really enjoyed it. It's my Thank pleasure. Thank you very much. Now, when you're talking trophy red stag, Shane Quinn's alpine hunting is my favorite destination. Alpine hunting has more red stag than New Zealand has sheep. Well, almost. But Kyle and his guide Shifty finally head out to the blind. All these animals look like trophies. That tree is 25 yards. And it wasn't long before the first big stag of the day appeared. We found him a mud bath over there. He's just going to town. Look at yeah, him. Yeah, they enough to have a water <laughs> cool. Look at that. Yeah. Mud always saw him. What a hoss. What an awesome stag. My first first stag with a bow, nine by nine. Yes, and it was a good shot. And it was very exciting, 25 yards away. He's got great antlers, but if you look at his body and his head, I mean, it looks like this guy would be like a middle linebacker. <laughs> Thanks for all your help, this was great. Yep, it's a pleasure. Here comes Shane. The next morning brought a new day and a new plan. This stag had a harem of about 10 hinds, and he was keeping an eye on each and every one of them. Good job, Diddy. Right down. Down, buddy. Right down. <laughs> right down. Unbelievable. Yep. He's absolutely gorgeous. The most special part of your adventure with the team at Alpine Hunting New Zealand is that you arrive as a client and leave as our friend. So for your hunt of a lifetime at the South Pacific's most prestigious hunting destination, including some good old fashioned Kiwi fun, give me a call, you'll never regret it. Thanks for watching, I'm Shane Quinn.